You know, I've never in my life met a person that seems to come out of their way to piss people off. It's if they were put on earth to be miserable and seek to make themselves miserable. So, I luckily had a warning before I got here because it is uh, after one and uh, this dude here is in my goddamn parking spot. Now, before I go on this little rant, uh, this guy tore up his bumper, lied about it, and then drove someone else's truck and tore his truck up, apparently ping pong in the building or something. I don't know if that's true or not, but that's what I heard. But, uh, yeah, I tore two bumpers up, a fender, and yeah. And uh, you think I want this guy parking that next to my car? He's not fucking wrong. He's sadly mistaken. <clears throat> because I know this dude. My car's black and it's dark. You make a right turn without pulling all the way out. And now you're on top of my car. So I do not trust this dude around my goddamn car. Now, the reason why he's in my spot is because... He doesn't want to move his pickup truck to put his truck in there. So this is his nonchalant way, I guess, is he's going to park the truck there. I park my truck where he was, and then I take my car home. Well, now he can put his pickup truck there, and then now he's got my spot. Now, mind you, I brought a trailer up and set up my spot, so he's going to try to take my spot because he's pissed off somebody that left the roll-off box where he parked his truck. So instead of him grabbing the goddamn box and moving it somewhere, like, oh, that goddamn hole over there, hell, that's, that's what, you know, the other end of the parking lot. So now, I gotta deal with this and move his goddamn truck and put my truck in that spot. Because he's sadly mistaken and misplaced his truck. So, and I knew this dude was gonna do this because I talked to him for a year. He turned out to be a goddamn douchebag, and and I knew this motherfucker was gonna pick fights with me. And then now here we are. You know, little child. So now, if he does anything else, I gotta call the boss, like we're goddamn in grade school. And tell sounds uh you know you know it's kind of embarrassing that to say it's like this dude is uh being a douche. So yeah, <sighs> what a sad pathetic man. Fucking bullshit, I tell you. <sighs> and he wonders why people fuck with him all the goddamn time. You know, it's like he goes out of his way to piss people off. Well, it's the last thing I want to fucking do. When I've fucking worked 12 or more hours and sat at a goddamn place to dump a load for four fucking hours and I come here and I deal with this bullshit. You know, I'm a nice person until I, dis I dislike you and he's fucking hit it. So, sadly mistaken if you think I'm passive because when I don't like you, I'm a dick. And now I'm a dick. So, congratulations. He better check himself.